Hey everybody, it's Robin. Long time no see. Um, I've missed being in here playing. Uh, I'm still going to have a little bit of time this week. i got to get prom stuff done, but we're making up baskets personalized for each of the seniors, so I'll share those with you later in the week. So, maybe even this weekend. Anyway, this here is a card I had to make. We're going to be at a wedding tomorrow. Some friends, Ryan and Lisa, are getting married tomorrow. And I'm so sad. I don't know about any of you guys, but the frames that I've been using on my 12 by 12 layouts, Michael's quit carrying them. And I'm going to send an email because it looks to me now, now I'll go back and they'll be it there and make a liar out of me. But they are putting some ugly, crappy ones in. It looks like they covered it with contact paper. So I'm sad, and I did not get to make her a layout with their last name and established 2012 because I'm not using an ugly frame. So anyway, this card I used, I'll go through the products first. This Miss Caroline Fiddlesticks collection. And I used this page for the fence down at the bottom. I used, I should have marked these. I'm sorry I didn't. So now I gotta flip till I find it. Ah! I used this page. I just kind of yelled out wedding and then this page for the doily spot here are some butterflies from recollections that I've had forever that I decided to use the yellow one and here is a stamp I believe this one I got at Michaels that I used in the background here's a stamp set from 2003 from Stampin Up husband wife happy life I got this from a friend, Laurie. Thanks, Laurie. And then here are my flowers. These are the S10. Looks like 153. It's a light yellow. And then from MFT Stamps, the fence die and the oval doily. So what I did was the navy blue piece in the background was from Stella Rose collection and I layered the fiddlesticks on top of that and I used my Tim Holtz distress it tool on the edges I didn't overly distress it just a little bit and adhered them together and I cut with my big shot the doily and the congrats die excuse me stamp that it's propped up on is from Stamp Abilities Hobby Lobby and I decided to kind of to stamp it down low and then stamp this in the background so I could have plenty of room for this butterfly up in the corner and then wrapping some of the flowers around it and uh, I love how the fence turned out it just looks so, I don't know, um, distressed in that. I just, I think it's cool. So, and I made the card five and a half by five and a half. And then on the inside, this is actually a little pocket to stick the money in. Um, I hate it when the money falls out. So, I'm going to stick a some money in there and a note for but I used oops one more piece and I think I can show you here we go I use this white piece for the inside fence on that and then just put a strip of the navy and the other piece down there at the bottom and then stamp the husband, wife, happy life. 
and then used the Martha Stewart punch that we all love and punched out two butterflies to put in each corner so I thought it turned out super cute so and then I sprayed the whole entire thing with scintillizing silver from stamp Lindy stamp gang so but there is my card share so if you have any questions just holler and some more pages from my son's guest book will be coming soon have a great weekend